Good morning. Today I want to talk about negative thoughts and how I changed my negative mindset. And I will give you step by step what I've done and what I do still and what helped. First things first, having a journal, gratitude journal. Every morning I wake up and I tell myself what I'm grateful for in myself and also in the world. Give my own self gratitude for waking up, for doing my best, for my heart, for people in my life, for good people, genuine people, kindness and generosity and etc. Now, that sets my day. That is, that creates the foundation which is peace and gr gratitude. Now, with our mind, we have so many thoughts. It is hard sometimes to catch them. What we can do is observe and meditate. That's where the meditation comes in and that's why a lot of people talk about meditations. Now, what I'm going to say is meditation is a long-term investment. So start small, two minutes a day, five minutes a day. Just sit in silence, still, and see what happens. And I'll tell you what happens towards the end of the video. Now, what happens when we have thoughts? We have a thought. We give that thought an emotional charge. And that emotional charge is coming from an underlying desire. And because of that, we take an action. And that thought manifests in reality. Let's say your thought was that you are not good enough. And that will manifest in your reality by your actions as being very insecure, comparing yourself, and etc. You got the point. That's why we gotta choose our thoughts carefully and what we wanna believe in. Now that you've understood that, first steps first, when you have thoughts, just write them down. Let's say that that thought that you had, which said you are not good enough, write it down. My mind says that I'm not good enough. My mind says that I will not succeed. My mind says yada, yada, yada. Now, the biggest step is done. You became aware. In order to work with something, you have to know about that thing, about the existence of that thing. You became, you became aware of that thought. So now it becomes easier to work with it. Second step is observe your body. When you have that thought, how does it feel? Feelings are important. What sensations do you feel in your body? Discomfort. Right? It doesn't feel good. When you have a thought that says that you are not good enough. And it's because you are good enough. You are enough. And when you have that thought which tells you something that is not true, it does not feel right. It doesn't feel good. Now, let's change it. Let's choose how we want to feel. Now, next step is question. Question your mind. Question everything that it says. Your, let's say your mind said, people are judging me. Question it. Ask, do you have evidence to support that? People are thinking that I'm not gonna, good enough. Do you have evidence to support that? People, or I feel that I'm never going to succeed. Do you have evidence to support that? You don't know the future. No. Question your mind by also asking, I wonder what my mind is going to come up with next. I'm sorry for the, the noise. Do not just accept everything. Question. After questioning, you'll be more relaxed. And it will become easier for you now to flip the coin. You know how coin has two sides. You are on one side right now. Where it says people are judging me. So now we got to flip to the other side. What would you say? You know that this thought doesn't feel good. So let's flip it by saying. My mind says that people are judging me. But I know that people are not judging they are living their own lives and even if they are 
I have no control over that. All I can control and focus on is myself. I will support myself even if people judge me. So now that you've changed the coin, see how you feel, see how it feels in your body. Keep on doing this for as long as you need. And with meditations, what it does is it helps you flip the coin faster. You'll find sometimes yourself being able to catch a thought, observe yourself and change your reaction and your actions and change the patterns easily. And that gives you this feeling of peace, satisfaction, fulfillment, joy, that you are the creator of your own reality. You are in control of yourself and nothing else. Now, hope this helps. Take care and speak soon. Bye-bye. And I forgot to add, be compassionate. Whatever comes, comes and just have compassion for yourself and for your emotions and thoughts. It's okay. It's just a human thing.